Parkland, FLA, Reuters, stunned by last week a Euro trademark s bloodiest high school shooting in US history, students across the country were mobilizing on Sunday for stronger gun laws, while Florida officials contemplated when to reopen their badly shaken school. Students from Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School, where a former student is accused of murdering 17 people on Wednesday, joined others on social media to plan rallies, a Washington march and a national walkout aimed at getting the attention of an adult population many say has failed to protect them. A Euro OEI felt like it was our time to take a stand, because, you know, we Euro trademark re the ones in these schools, we Euro trademark re the ones who are having shooters come into our classrooms and our spaces A Euro said Lane Murdoch of Richfield High School in Connecticut. Murdoch, a 15-old sophomore who lives 20 miles, 32 kilometers, from Sandy Hook Elementary School where 20 children and 6 adults were shot dead 5 years ago, drew more than 36,000 signatures on an online petition Sunday morning calling on students to walk out of their high schools on April 20. Instead of going to classes, she urged her fellow students to stage protests on the 19th anniversary of the mass shootings at Columbine High School in Colorado. Last week a Euro trademark s massacre in Florida, which followed several other school shootings this year, inflamed the country a Euro trademark s long simmering debate between advocates for gun control and gun ownership. For a graphic on Florida school shooting, click tmsnrt.r slash 2nx8 echo. Former student Nicholas Cruz, 19, faces multiple murder charges in the deaths of 14 students and three staff members, and the wounding of more than a dozen others, in a rampage that eclipsed Columbine as the country a Euro trademark s worst mass shooting at a high school. The charges can bring the death penalty, but prosecutors have not yet said if they will seek capital punishment. School officials in Broward County said on Sunday that they were aiming to have staff return to the Douglas High School campus by the end of the week. The school system a Euro trademark s announcement did not say when classes would resume. Cruz was reported to have been investigated by police and state officials as far back as 2016 after slashing his arm in a social media video, and saying he wanted to buy a gun. Authorities, however, determined he was receiving sufficient support, newspapers said on Saturday. In addition, the Federal Bureau of Investigation admitted on Friday that it failed to investigate a warning that Cruz possessed a gun and the desire to kill. President Donald Trump lashed out late on Saturday at the FBI for missing signs that could have prevented the shooting, and accused the agency on Twitter of a Euro spending too much time trying to prove Russian collusion with the 2016 Trump campaign a Euro. The Douglas High School students are planning a a Euro a March for our live ESA Euro in Washington on March 24 to call attention to school safety and ask lawmakers to enact some form of gun control. A Euro a you know. We Euro trademark remarching because eat a Euro trademark s not just schools, eat a Euro trademark s movie theaters, eat a Euro trademark s concerts, eat a Euro trademark s nightclubs. A Euro student Alex Wynn said on Enka Euro trademark s a Euro e meet the press a Euro a Euro or at these kind of stuff can a Euro trademark t just happen a Euro. A rally is set for Tallahassee, the state capital, on Wednesday where a lawmaker is seeking a legislative opening for a ban on the sale of assault weapons, including the AR-15 that Cruz is alleged to have used. Democratic State Senator Linda Stewart, who represents Orange County, where 49 people were massacred at the Pulse nightclub in 2016, said she needs to gain support from three Republicans, who control the state legislature, to win passage of her measure but hopes to force a vote even if it fails. A Euro OE I think that putting them on record is what needs to be done right now A Euro said Stewart, who said she plans to meet with Douglas High School students in the Capitol on Tuesday night.